welcome back to my channel. This is Belinda and Delani. So it's tonight, guys. It's dark outside, so it's tonight. But we are going to be making some oatmeal raisin cookies. We also going to put walnuts in them. And so we decided to pick up the camera and let you guys um, see how we make them. Kelani, you have anything to say? Okay, guys. So, me and my granny, we cooking cookies. Mm -hmm. And so we got all this agreement, bread and cookie stuff, and this is my granny. And I've been at her phone house because I love her. Because I love my granny, and I got my dress on, so I can't get ready to cook with my granny. And I got my fingernails painted from Granny Michelle, and that picture looks so cute. And we got all these ingredients. Okay, this is the recipe, guys. If y'all want to screenshot it, you pretty much cream the butter and the sugar together. I mean, yeah, the butter the sugars and then your eggs together and uh, let it get fluffy or whatever and then you start to add your other ingredients like your vanilla and your soda. You can mix your soda, salt and uh, baking powder in with your flour and then you're um, also going to use the two oats. And down here it said chocolate chips. I'm not going to use chocolate chips. I'm going to use raisins. And, and I'm also gonna use the walnuts. So I'm going to put you on our tripod and this just a bag, just saying you cream together. Um, I should've put sugar and butter, but I didn't put that, but. Uh, so we're gonna get started and put you on the tripod and we're gonna get started on eat cookies. Oh, I forgot guys to show you the ingredients. So you're gonna need one teaspoon of vanilla a half a teaspoon of baking powder, a half a teaspoon of baking soda. You're gonna need some oats. You're gonna need some flour, two eggs, a cup of butter, so that's two sticks of butter, big as a cup. You're gonna need a cup of granulated sugar and a cup of brown sugar. And back over here, I have my raisins here and I just toss them with some flour so they won't sink to the bottom. They're just a little trick if, um, so your, your, whenever you're adding something to your cookies or your cake, if you don't want it to just sink to the bottom, you can put a little flour in it. So I got flour and the raisin and I did also, I also did it with the walnut. So I always do my cookie dough in my food processor. It's just where I, um, rested out or whatever but I always do my cookies in my food processor and then once I get them all mixed up I will either put it in a bowl depending on how much in here if it's enough where I can just blend in the raisins and the walnut because you don't want to uh, you know make, you want to just fold them in that's what I'm trying to say so we're going to get started guys now that's enough let's see good job cookie we cooking cookie. Well, all the way up to right here.
comment below if you like this video because we finna cook right now and get the thumbs up. Woohoo! Thumbs up! Thumbs yeah. up! Thumbs up! We need those thumbs up. Oh! And guys, don't forget to never subscribe and hit the channel on Granny YouTuber. Yes, and subscribe. And subscribe to the comments. Thank <laughs> you like me and our Granny. And comment below if you like me and Granny. Alright, now, now we're going to put the lids it. on it. Okay. Oh, you can go ahead and stop it. Go ahead and stop it. Uh -uh. You got to make sure the light on. See the light on? And then you want to do uh, dough right here. You want to do the dough. guys so this is done and i press the button and it's all but the other one is still on right here but guys look this is so cute they saw it baby i'll show them on the camera i'm just gonna scrape scrape down the some of the sugar and butter and then we'll turn it back on and finish blending it yeah. so i want to make sure we get all the butter and the sugar incorporated and the dough so and i do have the plastic um uh, blaze in there like this is the metal i have the plastic and i do my cookies with the plastic okay now press the button now we have to turn this back we're gonna put this back on and make sure it's always right here on this side see the arrow point and the arrow point always and then once you put it on there you push this down and it locks so go ahead and right. how creamy it is yeah, cream. creamy cream hold on i see a piece of brown sugar in here a hard little piece of brown sugar i'm gonna take that out I'm take that out, and then I see another little piece in there. Get this off. Another spoon over here. Granny, I wish cannot be done. I know, baby. All right, guys. Next, we're gonna add the eggs, Kilani. Make sure you, with two hand, make sure you pour it all the way in there. Yes. Let me scrape that. Oops, sorry. It's okay. I hope it's I hope that turned out right. Cause I'm it's kind of sticky in there. Okay. Take that, you can wipe your hands off. Take the sink. Okay, we're gonna go ahead on and bring that. Oh here you go. Thank you. Thank you, Papa. Baking powder and my salt mix in here. 
So next we are going to add um, we add the flour next. Pour just a little flour in there, not all of it. A little bit more. My, my hands full it. Okay. And now we're going to pack, pour half of the oats in there. Oh. Remember I said come up some? Okay. Now we're going to put this on. Make sure you put how it's supposed to be. Put it all in there. It's not in there. I'm just preheating the oven and to get it hot until I get this done. Until we get ready to cook it. Right now, they're in there right now. All right, come on. Go ahead and add the raisins. The raisins. Mm -hmm. pour. Uh, pour them in there. Just pour them in there. Now at this point, you can either, uh, you know, mix it in like this, or you can um, mix it with your hands. So I think that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go and get our hands washed, and we'll come back, guys, and we're gonna start. Um, you know, we're gonna kill all them talking. Okay, we're gonna mix this up, guys, and then we'll come back. All right, guys, we got it all mixed up. Now we are going to get ready to start uh, putting them on our cookie sheet. Let me grab the cookie sheet. These are the two cookie sheets we're gonna use tonight. Oh, sorry about that, guys. So we are going to fill this one up and then we will do the second one because it's quite a bit of dough. And I wish I still had my cooking scoop. I need to get me another cooking scoop, but I think I got an idea of something that I can use. I have these old-fashioned ice cream scoop. These was my mother-in-law and I see it got the holes in it, so they must have been connected together some kind of way. But that one says scoop up saving with instant mash and uh, this one got scoop on it. So, I think this will work if we get like a scoop of it and put it on the cookie sheet. 
and kind of pull that with our hands. Let's see, did y'all see how I did? I'm gonna do another one, show y'all what I'm talking about. So, get a scoop, and then put it, and then you might have to take our hands and kind of help take it out. And just like that, don't mash it or anything. Just let it stay. So I'm gonna let Kilani work on this one, and I'm gonna use the other scoop, and I'm gonna do the, fill the other one up. guys it is deeper in the grandma mittens let's see let's turn out the turn and y'all they look so delicious okay hold on guys I'm gonna put the camera down because I need to get something to sit down on Oh, these look so delicious. You can see that little brown on the bottom. And what I do is I just leave them on the cookie sheet and it will finish cooking. I didn't even get a chance to clean up my mess before the thing went out, before the um, time went out, guys. So that's what I'm doing, moving around stuff. Cause like I said, I didn't have any time. I went to the bathroom and Kilana came and knocked on the door. Granted, the timer is going off. So I'm like, oh my God. Okay, guys, let me get the other one out. do a taste test they're not very very cool though but Kilana just can't wait so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video but I just want to say guys that I thank you so much for your continued support I thank you so much for subscribing to my channel all the new ones I even have a sister from another country I don't really know um, her name or anything but I can't understand it but I understand enough to know that she subscribed and she liked my videos. So thank you so much. Um, my sister, let's get on, put your cookie down for just a second. Let's give her a heart emoji. Okay. Come on, do it like this. Do it like this. There you go. All right. This is for everybody. We love you guys. And uh, if you haven't subscribed, guys, please subscribe to our channel. We love to cook over here. We love the Lord. I mean, we love decorating. Just We just love doing things. So, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, go ahead and do that. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Let us know in the, bottom, in the comment section what type of cookies do you guys like. So, now it's time for us to taste the cookies. So, Kelani, you have something to say? Okay, guys. So, we're going to try this now. Let's try it. Okay. It's very soft. So you can mm, see it fall got, apart. I guess and, mm. it, and it's so delicious. So mm. comment below if you like cookies. Oatmeal raisin cookies. Oatmeal raisin Let me show y'all what it look like in time. Look at him. Oh my goodness, y'all. Uh -huh. It's just falling apart. Uh oh, I'm dropping. That's okay. And All right, I got guys. some too. All right, guys. We love y'all and we'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.